We're visiting the Chateau of the Loire Valley. It's just about an hour outside of Paris by the high-speed train, and it is the third most popular area in the country to visit after Paris and the Mediterranean. We are driving out from the city of Tours, which has been our home base for visiting the Loire Valley, taking a day trip by van to see some of the surrounding sites. Chateau Cheverny is another top tourist attraction of the Loire, renowned for magnificent interiors and its collection of furniture and its dog kennels. <laughs> we'll have more hounds coming up in a moment. A visit of the chateau is a pure delight which reveals the art of aristocratic French living at its best. There is a central grand salon on the ground floor, a stone staircase dated to 1634 and carved with trophies of arms in the art brings you up to the grand apartments. A guard room with arms and armor leads to the Chambre du Roi, richly hung with five Paris tapestries representing the story of Ulysses. Chiverny cherishes its long traditions, but it played no important role in French history. In the past, the chateau was a homelike and peaceful abode for many centuries, protected from the world beyond. Amazingly, the chateau owners are descendants of the same family who originally built it in the early 17th century. A hundred dogs live at Chiverny, so be sure to have a look at them. They can be seen all day during your visit. These hunting hounds are publicly fed at 5 p.m. every day from April through September and taken out for hunts twice weekly. The family opened the chateau to the public in 1914, one of the very first to do so. And they still operate it today. <laughs> Our series about the Chateau of the Loire is also bringing you to Amboise, Chambord, Aze, and Blois, and a few other places with our home base in the city of Tours. Have a look at our YouTube channel and our website for more movies about this beautiful region and many videos about the rest of France.